You've heard of ice dancing, single skating, and pair skating, but what about synchronized skating? Here at the Terry Connors Ice Rink in Stamford, the Southern Connecticut synchronized skating team is getting ready for the 2015 Eastern Synchronized Skating Sectional Championships in Lake Placid. It's a feeling unlike any other, just being on the ice, knowing that even though I can't do something perfectly, I can always go out there and give my best shot. 40 ice skaters from seven towns throughout Fairfield County make up three skating teams, the Sprites, Shimmers, and the Shadows. Gina Valenzo Gomez coaches all of them. It's been here for a long time. I actually skated on one of the first teams that was here. It's based on five um, basic elements in synchronized skating, um, and they skate to music. The, basically, they do circles, blocks, pinwheels, lines, and intersections. It's a lot to incorporate. You've got those five basic elements that you have to incorporate, and then you have to sort of, you know, layer on them. You're adding footwork, and you're um, adding choreography, and you're trying to make everything from simple to more complex and enhance it so that you get the best mark. According to the United States Figure Skating Association, it's one of the fastest growing ice sports in the world with growing momentum to add synchronized skating in time for the 2018 Olympic Games. But for now, these skaters have their eyes set on the prize in Lake Placid. It's, it's a team, so it's like, it's not just on you. It's like, you have to rely on everyone. And you make really great friendships and you learn about working together. As the years that I have been on the Shimmers, I definitely want to um, make my family proud and like this um, skating team proud of what I'm doing. And their love of the sport goes beyond competition time. I just really love how I can share the sport with other people and I see like the love of the younger kids and how much they love the sport when I'm teaching it to them. I didn't think I would stick with it this long or love it this much and gain a, such a connection with these girls that hopefully will last forever. You can find out links and more information about the team on our website. Reporting in Stamford, I'm Quadriba Crawfee for It's Relevant News.